Hey Naomi, thanks for your excellent video response. Uh, I just got back from uh, a hike myself and uh, I had this kind of uh, moment of is this, am I doing what I should be doing? Because um, I woke up on the first day of my weekend and I knew I had lots of things um, that I should do. Some things I've been putting off for a really long time. But uh, my mind just said, uh, you know, summer is so fleeting. Um, perhaps you should go, uh, go, go hiking and go camping uh, while you have the opportunity. And you know, things that have waited a long time could wait a little longer. And so when I went out there, uh, I went out to my spot along the Sandy River um, and did my kind of routine that I've done. Uh, you know, going to sit by the water, then going to sit by the shade, uh, cooking food, and sitting around, uh, making a few uh, a few malt liquor videos, and uh, reading my book, and and then I was sitting there thinking, is this what I should be doing? Like, like maybe I should. I, I'm I'm near a whole bunch of different trails, um, but I and I couldn't tell. I was like thinking, well, this is what I'm happy doing right now, but I don't know if it's what I should be doing. Like the whole idea of like, I, I need to take advantage of the summer and maybe maybe repeating myself a whole lot isn't, uh, isn't the best use of my time or the best use as a way to uh, use nature to uh, improve upon myself. And I couldn't tell, I couldn't figure it out, but I was sure of one thing that I was uh, really happy and really comfortable just sitting there and staring at the mountain. I just stared at the mountain for two days. Um, and so it didn't, it, didn't, it didn't feel wasteful. There was only just this kind of doubt in my mind that I wasn't doing the right thing. And then I started thinking about uh, uh, this uh, episode of Smallville. I, I heart Smallville. Um, where uh, Lex Luthor finds his uh, his long lost brother that he believed died, and uh, his long lost brother meets Lex, and then he meets uh, Clark Kent, and uh, uh, I think Clark says it must have been uh, tough living on the streets, and uh, he's the, the the younger brother said uh, no, I don't believe so. I believe actually that. Um, it allowed me to be who I really am. You know, I didn't have um, a family or even a society around me, uh, you know, teaching me how to behave or uh, telling me who I am. And uh, one of them expressed some doubt at this concept, and uh, the guy says, "Well, come on. Do you believe if you guys have switched uh, switched families?" Uh, it'd be anything different other than you'd be wearing the flannel and you'd be wearing the, uh, you know, thousand dollar suit, driving a Ferrari. Um, so it's, it's just kind of food for thought in that, you know, I decide who I am, I decide what I want to do, but really am I, am I really making that much of a personal choice or if I'm, am I choosing from amongst the things uh, that I'm already aware of? I don't know, it's kind of hard. I guess the idea being that I should try as much as possible, but then also listen to when something inside me says this feels right. Like sitting here and staring up at the mountain uh, feels right. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I have anything more to add on that other than uh, that's where my mind was going uh, while I was out there in the hiking, camping, extravaganza. All right, Naomi, you know where I'll see you.